How's it going YouTube? It's your boy Dre here back again with another banger for you guys today. We got part two continuing the story of Cyberpunk 2077. We're continuing the, the intro, the heist. I hope you guys enjoy. Uh, get this video up, run it up, man. Run it up to five likes. Watch the video all the way through. Like and subscribe for more. You already know how we get down over here. Self love is the best love. If you can't love yourself, you can't love anybody else. And don't forget to keep the Lord for the rest of your life. Seek Him and seek the kingdom. And as always, if nobody has anything to love you, I love you guys. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Bye, guys. About a surprise yesterday. Am I remembering right or just had a brain fart? Probably both, because you usually forget shit. But Man, it just so yeah. happens. I think I might have bagged us a sweet ass J-O-B. Go on. I'm I mean, listening. maybe it's not as big as that, but just that he's fronted by a little known someone named Dexter Deshaun. Only the top fixer in night fucking city. Badass black Jesus of the afterlife. 300 pounds of partly gold plated cool. <laughs> How'd you manage to pull this? Trade in your spleen or something? As far as I know, we're not the type to get fingered by Dex. You and me? No. Oh, but T-Buck, she's the one that hooked us up. Got us talking. Knew it was a done deal the moment he laid eyes on me. Cause come on, ain't nobody who can resist this. Am I right? <laughs> sure, Jack. Whatever you say. Dexter Deshaun? What's the latest spec on him? I know you got info to spill. He's been off the grid for about two years. Word on the street was he took a little vacay. Two years? That's exile, not a vacation. What was he up to? Uh, guessing he shoved pizzas in his mouth while jerking off the hardcore virtues. The important thing is he's back. He's a fresh crew, and he found us. So what's the gig? We meant to come out in one piece? Our Lord and Savior wants to tell you everything himself, face to face. Oh, no pressure, but uh, this whole deal, he's riding on you now, I see. Why me? Why do I gotta go? You and T-Bug draw straws without me? T-Bug and Dex go way back, and my face is yesterday's news. All oh, Dex says he needs to check you, talk to you. Look, V, it's his job, his rules. I can't blame him for taking a personal approach. And it ain't as bad as you think, okay? Trust me. Guess I got no choice then. Literally, no choice, huh? Dex is a real yeah, so. deal when it comes to fixers. Don't get me wrong. Don't got nothing against the Padre or Wakako, but Dex is in a league of his own. You know what I'm saying? Don't get me started on fixers. They catch a client, find the cheapest gong to do the job, then drop their corpse at a landfill. Shit. Hit the nail on the head, V. Gracias, Dios. Estoy lleno. Brought your wheels. Gave them to my guy yesterday to smooth over the dents after our uh, dust up with the scabs. Thanks, Jack. Much appreciated. Top-notch work Miguel did. Rides like it looks. Factory new. We'll see about that. So we rolling or what? Let's feel this factory new ride. I'll sit tight over here. Me and Misty got a little catching up to do. 
you were pleased. Yeah. Hey, it's a Nikki cat. Hey, Nikki cat. Okay, what do you want? Why are you looking like that? What's up with this kid, bro? Why you got the strap in your hand like that, bro? Don't kill yourself. Vicky, surprise every old ripper. It's good to see you. Good to see you too, V. It's been a while. To what do I owe the pleasure today? Last gig. Had to jack into a client's neuro socket. Think I might have gotten spiked. Experiencing migraines, nausea, hypersensitivity to bright lights. Old kit and caboodle. All right, kit. We'll sort you out in a flash. Besides that. How are things? Met a new fixer. He gave me a job. Name's Dexter Deshawn. Known quantity from the afterlife. No denying you're moving up. But something you're not telling me, Vic? Keep your guard up, that's all. I've heard some things about Dex. He's not as chill as he makes himself out to be. Need some new kit, but tools, not toys, Vic. Time I bumped up my sights and got a grip. <laughs> really? Now? Finally? Vic, shit's getting real. Got a job from Dex to Sean, hitting the major leagues. Need tech that can perform. The Dexter Deshaun? <laughs> well, that is something. But let me guess. Hasn't paid you yet. Quit crying, Vic. I'll bring you the Eddies later. With interest, you know I will. Hmm. Last time, you hear? Chair, please. Sit down and relax. Kuroshi Optics. Best I've got. And should be about right under the circumstances. Now, Jack in. Kuroshi? Whoa. Vic, nothing tops that on the market. Hmm. Sounds like it could come in handy then. I gave you my word I'd pay you back, but this might be too rich for my blood. We'll work something out. Right now? I'm just out to make sure you get back in one piece. Eddie's in hand. You peruse and choose while I scan. Let's see what's going on inside. Okay.
restores your stamina when you defeat an enemy. Mark one, like I said. Decent enough scanner. Displays data on your cornea. Cherry on the top's a built-in external lens disruptor. In layman's terms, any surveillance cam will capture your face as a blur. And just remember, your body will still show up as crystal clear. Hmm. Hmm. This should do the trick. Talks to Kuroshi Tech, too. I'm ready. Carve away. Excellent. Let's do this. Lay that major league arm of yours right here. So, what's new in the life of Victor Vector? <sighs> yeah, if I'm being honest, not much. And that's fine with me. I used to live in a world where all that mattered was who's who, what's what, and how's why. And what happened? One day, I just dropped it and never looked back. I'll never be a legend in this town, but been sleeping nights ever since. Just like that. Thanks. Now, a bit of anesthetic and I can start cutting. Feel anything? Same as always. Don't feel a thing. Hmm. He asks me that every time, you know? Not as if things are gonna be any different today. Sure thing, kid. I mean, not like there's any risk of a stroke or paralysis, but <laughs> what do I know? I'm just a doctor. That's what I thought. Lights out for a minute, all right? Okay, let's test this. See the magic in action. Linking you in. You might feel a little discomfort at first. Blurred vision, low contrast, glitches. Could you imagine, bro, your eyeball being uh, like How's a... it look? Feel all right to you? They take your eyeball out, bro, and it's a camera. They put your eyeball back in, but it's like a camera, bro. It's crazy. Gonna keep me waiting all day. Oh, this is fantastic, Vic. <laughs> oh, beautiful. Time for the scanner. It might take you a few seconds to adjust, but first time's rarely the charm <laughs> with anything, really. Scanner should eventually sync with your thought processes and read your intentions. I also inject an NCPD file search. Run into any ne'er-do-wells? <laughs> you know exactly what they ne'er-did well. <laughs> it ought to work like a charm. Now draw your weapon. You should see your ammo count in a brand new sight. How about the neurovirus? From the last job. Can you check it? Done and gone while we were putting in your implant. And a full sweep on your soft and circuits. Zap the critter. You're certified bug free. Shit, Victor, not bad. I don't know what to say. Say you'll take this and remember the dosage. Two whiffs now, and another two in an hour. 
What am I looking at? A mild stem. Should boost neurotransmission in the short term and muffle some of the side effects while the implant takes. Hmm. Thanks again, Vic. You're the best. I owe you. <laughs> Go on, kid. Show them what you're made of. And once you hit the big leagues, don't forget where you came from. Nice kitty. I can release it for you, but you'd have to watch out for negative energy fields and avoid mean reds. V, yo, listen up. I talked to Dex while you were in with the doc. He's waiting in his ride for you. Ain't but a hop to where he's parked next to Gramsci Burgers. Okay, do my best to talk us up. How's biz, Misty? Booming? <sighs> You're the first person to walk in here for two days. And two days ago, it was a pizza guy. Got lost. People in this town, they've lost their spiritual connection. But well, you know, I'm here to serve them, not the other way around. No, well, that's good, yeah. Put those uh, tarot cards away, my boy. We're not doing all that. That's, that's not it. V, listen, I've got this delicate matter. That's why I called you. The number of cyber psycho attacks in the city is on the rise. Now that's probably not news to you, but this issue matters to me for a few reasons. There are people who say cyber psychosis can be treated. Right. And I know exactly how that sounds, but I believe even an unproven therapy is still better than a bullet to the brain. If I get a tip about a possible attack, I'll give you a call. Maybe you can investigate before Max Tap hits the scene. But remember, you're not there to execute anybody. Try to incapacitate the attacker, and I'll send someone to pick him up. I hope that's all clear. Even within us, your joys, your worries, your life, for them it is all mere spectacle! Let's just say you're right. So what? Should I just gouge out my optics? Thanks, but no thanks. You are beyond salvation, but not the children of the future! Life untainted by surgery of the sacrilege. We can yet save them. May the mothers shield their bodies. May the fathers instill their hatred for Crow. But who are those who follow our every step, you ask? Why, the titans of entertainment in Alpha Centauri! In their wretchedness, they placate their weary and oppressed masses by putting our laughter, our tears, on oh, full display! Oh Look, a real conspiracy guy. Like in that show. Quick, get next to him. I'll snap still if you are arresting him for revealing government secrets. Open your mind before it is too late. <laughs> Jessica will like die when she sees this. Like, this is Max Nova. I just can't. I recognize you. You come here often. Your eyes tell me that your mind has opened to the truth. Will you provide a humble donation so that I may continue my mission? Get a job. <laughs> no! 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 Oh my gosh, bro. Why did I do that? Do good work. Use this to wake Night City up. Thank you for your devotion. I saw a disciple of truth in you from the very beginning. Bro, wait a minute. You were talking about you shouldn't have radio implants, waves. The truth. But you got implants right now. You got the chip, bro. Behold. 
What you mean, bro? You got the chip, bro. You just received Their money. Their mothership from you. conceals like itself like above our go. very heads. Here's the money, Ready bro. yourself, mm -hmm. for they are coming. I'm just. Yo, Mr. V, a pleasure. Dexter Deshaun in the flesh. Ample indeed. <laughs> Let's roll. Mind if I ask you something right off the bangle? Go ahead. Would you rather live in peace as Mr. Nobody, die ripe, old, and smelling slightly of urine, or go down for all times in a blaze of glory, smelling near like posies, without seeing your 30th? You're either somebody, or you fizzle out into nothing. Night City don't let you choose. Oh, but it does. See, in my line of work, I choose to be Mr. Chill. But folk who try to take advantage, well, they see the beast inside. All right, listen close. Scanning a serious job now. Playing gargantuan compared to smashing up a scav home. Uh, Mr. V? Hang on. I got a question of my own now. Why all this, Dex? Why me? Could have had Jackie or T-Buck sitting here. Could have just done this on comms. Call me old-fashioned, but I like to look anyone I do biz with in the eye. Had the pleasure of meeting the Jackster in the past, and sweet T-Bug helped this brother out two years ago. So here we are. Besides all that, Got a special little pre-mission just for you, but we'll get to that. Let me hear it. What's the job? There's this prototype tech, a biochip to be precise. Jobs to grab it. Simple. Yeah. <laughs> Guessing it belongs to a corp. Mm-hmm. Arasaka. Surely that's no problem. No, no problem. Just a death sentence. NC's Arasaka's turf. Nobody fucks with them here. What can I say, Mr. V? High risk, high reward. First rule of the afterlife. Besides that, I'm no leadhead. Ain't gonna leave no trace for them to follow because we're gonna do this clean and on the hush-hush. We understand each other. You work this out? Got a plan? Two things. First, a conundrum with the Maelstrom boys. Needs active resolve in that. Second to rendezvous. Simple. Client who brought us the job's anxious. She wants to parlay with one of the team. What's the issue needs resolving with Maelstrom? Got a beef? Slot in the shard. Got a classic tale for you. Psycho gang doing his thing two weeks back. Jumped a Militech convoy. Got away with the gear. Corp don't even know Maelstrom's involved. Now see, convoy was carrying the flathead, a little combat bot, a prototype. And I need me that bit of high grade military tech. Cause if we don't get that bot, we don't get no soccer chip. And we sure as hell don't get no happily ever after. But don't get excited. It's a single-use toy. Now, I flat-out purchased the damn thing from Maelstrom. Problem is, I did so from a gent went by the name of Brick. I say when, because Brick was the leader. Three days after we'd sealed our deal, his friend and gangmate, one Simon Randall, AKA Royce, plain dropped his ass. Royce is in charge now, and I got no way of knowing if he aims to honor his predecessor's word. To add to this shitstrom, one Meredith Stout of Militech has developed an interest in said convoy. Mm. Royce guy, what's he like? A straight psychopath, chrome-loving kind. Big club in this town. I'll give you that, 
except few of its other members. No matter the stakes, would put a friend and associate through an industrial microwave dryer. Apparently, first thing to burst are the eyeballs. Get a nice clear pop. Then the rest goes goulash. Who's the prima donna? Corpo agent, internal affairs. Been skidding around town asking after the convoy as if her life depended on finding it. The one lead she's got zip tied in her trunk. Stick up her ass ain't growing any shorter. So she must be getting desperate. Be wise to think how you could use that. Of course, to do so, you'll need that frazzled cat's info. Sending it now. Klein, what's her thing? Why she need to meet? Woman's name's Evelyn Parker. Betting her wasn't easy. Put the word out I was looking for any kind of intel. Right, and? Some brothers from Pacifica got back to me. Told me to stop looking. End of convo. <laughs> Anyway, our little client insisted on meeting someone with skin in the game. You know, who'll be there for it all. Yours truly will be remote. T-Bug ain't no people person, and Jaggy's only good at some things. I know you know what I mean. Pretty much leaves you. I think I got everything. Time I got to work. Well, that's just music to my ears. I'll set up the meet with Miss Parker at Lizzie's bar. Flathead, though, is gonna be all you. For sure, man. I One got more it. thing, Mr. V. What's up? Quiet life or blaze of glory? Hmm? Later now. Quiet life. Jackster, talk to Dex. Yeah, <laughs> Gordito's a big deal. Literally a nug. Guy certainly knows how to protect his biz. Wants to put us on a few small kinks. Prep work, I guess. Before lining us up a big job. There's this combat bot, military prototype. Maelstrom clepped it. Then Dex paid to take it off their hands just before the gang goons had a switch up in management. Right, heard about that. Royce versus Brick. Hostile takeover. That sums it up. Dex wants us talking to Royce. Gave the deets of some Militech agent, too, but... I don't know how much help she stands to be. Ha! <laughs> she gone. Then there's the other thing. Gotta meet the client who put the job on the table. Evelyn Parker. You? Well, what's Dex gonna do? Ride around in his limo, chat chicks up on the hollow? Parker wants to meet someone on the crew. Dex gave me the nod. He must know what he's doing. So, how you want to play this? Maelstrom or Parker? What's first? I say Go we knock on Maelstrom's Maelstrom. door first. Let's go see Pound, what Maelstrom actually. wants to do. Orale. In Orale. that case, I'll hit the off roads. Put my nose to the ground. Step around. Hasta luego. Lively. Meredith Stout. Take it you were the one to call? Got an offer for. Okay. Thought you could blackmail me, fucker! Set conditions! Got any more for me? Calm the fuck down! I just wanna talk! What's he doing, bro? Christ, Meredith! Shut your trap! That fucking thing ready? All set. Now answer my questions. Honestly. Forthrightly. Are you here alone? Got guardian angels with 50 caliber snipes aimed at your skull. You don't let me go. Your dogs will have to glue you back together. He's lying. He's lying. <laughs> Try that again, and it's two million volts. Got it? <laughs> no! Okay, so it's a lie detector. Do a sweep, now. 
Now listen close. This piece of shit, Anthony Gilchrist. Is he your contact? Is he the one who leaked intel on the convoy? Never met anybody named Gilchrist. That the poor fucker right there? It's true, doesn't know him. That said, I've jumped a few convoys in my day. Know all the usual suspects. Bet I can help find your mole. But what I know now won't get you anywhere in that respect. Listen, I know where the transport is. I can help you. Just want a favor in return. <sighs> I told you! I fucking told you! I'm not the mole! Jesus Christ! Shut him up! Unhand me now before I... Ugh. Him, you can let go. Want to hear what he has to say? You know, I could help patch the gaps in your convoy security. Prevent a repeat of this fiasco. Nope, not interested. Let's hear your offer. I don't have all day. Couldn't have been chill from the start. Shut the fuck up. Tell me what you want. I need a bot. Flathead model. Guys who ripped you off have it. Promise me that bot. I'll point the finger. You have a plan how to deal with them? Could just take it by force. But they're expecting payment, so I could go that route, too. Fine, the latter. But on one condition. You pay with our money. Sounds solid enough. I'm in. You pay with that chip, and that's all you gotta worry about. Try to fuck me in any way, and I'll be seeing you real soon. You're making a mistake! This gun's already good as dead! But she'll take you down with her! Hiya, por fin! Let me hear what you squared away. Then an arch? Oh, damn. What a beaut. Yeah, I got her cheap, too. Dorset job. 170 day. horsepower. Hmm. Don't know how you could scrape together enough for that beast. Even used. Well, I, I took out a loan, but muy pequeñito. But I mean, it's totally worth it. t book show any sign of life? You two talk? She's up to date, fired up to work with Dex. Preparing already. They're familiar, you know? Worked together before Dex took his break. Been waiting long. My mother always said patience pays off, so... So Dex already paid the Maelstromers for the Corpo bot. Thing is, can't be sure the gang goons are still willing to hand it over. He paid up front? Híjole. Well, whatever. Let's go get this tech. You scheme yet? You got a plan? Militech and me long. found some common ground. They're footing the bill for the bot. There's a lot of scratch to toss away. Forget it, Jack. It'll be like we never had it in the first place. Anyway, who knows how this deal's gonna shake out. So, into the Borg Beast then? Give me a minute. Okay, tell me when you're good and steeled. Let's go see these bastards. All right, let's knock on their door. Come on, Jackie. Let's go, bro. I hate these Borg fuckers. Just had to be them. Just a gang like any other, right? I'll take the Valentinos. They follow God and the Santa Madre. Honor means something to them. You know what they want, how they get it, and what pisses them the fuck off. Open the fucking door. Yeah? You make a fucking appointment? Cause I don't see nothing in my book. Bro, I thought it Wanna talk to Royce. Dex sent us. Main room. 
a few plants though oh yeah they look damn well prepared don't think I've ever seen security like this in a chow factory yeah, gear from the jack convoy gotta be must have been all over it magazine you hear about their boss Royce Dex mentioned him called him special that's Militech all right Psycho board scrummed out with military grade hardware with millions. This should be fun. What just mean? Anti personnel mine. Directional shrapnel spitter. My favorite. Subtle. Anti personnel mine. Directional shrapnel spitter. My favorite. Subtle. Stay cool. They're just trying to spook us. Get in the elevator! Fucking sheep! I'm wanted for first degree murder. Here to see Royce. We got biz to transact. Mr. Royce is busy just now. You'll deal with me. You got a bot. Model MT0D12. Called the Flathead. And? The hell you care? Guy I represent already paid brick for it. I'm just here for the pickup. I can talk direct to Royce if necessary. Nah. You talk to me. Name's Tum Tum. Now couch, planet. What's wrong with you, Jack? Uh, well, shit. Goes for you, too. I'll stand. This so fucking hard? Fucking ass on the fucking couch! Make me. Thought you'd never ask. See your ass down for a Jack, planet bullet. Sit down. This ain't gonna end well, but shit. Well, all right. Come on. Got lighten up. Take a hit. What is it? A skeef. Shit kicks you in the ass. It's a fucking rush, man. Gotta feel it for yourself. Come on, give it a whirl. Thanks, I'm good. Whatever you say, straight-edged princess. Here we go. The Flathead. Model MT-0-D-12. Militech's not gonna come looking for it? Fuck them. They can hop around and try. We'll remove the serial number and lift it access locks using our soft. Once it's yours, it's yours. Need to see it. Suit yourself. Fucking tricked out this thing. Dynamic thermal optic camo armor. Full cognitive immersion with a Raven controller. Pimped out prototype actuators made of titanium vanadium Kevlar composite. Mm. And watch this. Fully integrated link tube. 
So when the spider starts crawling up walls dangling from ceilings... Mm-hmm. Could lose your lunch. So what you think? Yep, we'll take it. Free. Sure. Yeah. Let's see your cred. Brick got it. It's all paid up. Brick got it. Huh. I don't see any fucking brick around here, do you? Fuck brick, then. Let's cut a new deal. <sighs> Now that's good business sense. All right, you want the flathead? I better see some eddies. Seeing as you already got the eddies for it, you ought to offer us a discount. A big one. A discount? Fuck. You know, you never did say who sent you. Never did say who you're working for. Dexter Deshaun. That's who. Dexter Deshaun, the lord ass who punching animal fucked half a Pacifica. <laughs> he ain't dead. No, he's alive, well, and kicking. And he sends his regards. So you're gonna consider my offer now? <sighs> mm -hmm. Creds on this. <sighs> hey, Flathead's good gear. It'll do the trick for you, whatever the trick is. Shit! Shit, shit, shit! Chip's got a vector! They're breaking in! Zero! Are you on this? Unload on them, B! Cut loose! Shit! Where's they go, Rod? One fucker left. Mierda. Cut. Well, that didn't go the way I thought it would go. Off. Grab the gear. Bot and control side. Quick. I gotta find a way out of here. Got the set, bot and controller. Then let's go. Quicker the better. Now let's get out of here. I'm dying for some fresh air. Jackie, let's get out of here. I hope they failed his feet. Ah, I could taste it. It's a production line. Plus, I thought you loved me. Really, no other way. Oh, good. Let's go. Let's go.
Quick hack. What are these messages, bro? Detonator armed. Hey, yo, hey, hey, help me out over here. Oh, shit, I know this fool. It's Brick. It's your call, B. What do you want to do? Guess it's kind of your fault we're here. Came for some tech Dex bought. He tell you to free me? No, just to pick up the body. Classic fucking Dex. <laughs> Been in here a while? Few days. Kinda lost count. Some guys loyal enough to care slip me stuff, tried to help out. Royce threw him in the microwave dryer. Made me watch. Looking a little like we might have saved your skin. I think we're due a favor, hombre. Jesus, slow down, maybe. I'll get you, but kinda caught me at a bad time. We ever meet again, I'll have you covered. Sure you'll manage all right? This is my home. Quit fucking sweating it. We saved old boy. Guess that's all that mattered, yeah? Are there any more enemies? Oh, wait.
I'm like already out of bullets. Okay. That ain't good. Okay, I mean literally out of bullets, bro. This ain't good. Asked me if I changed, I said big time. Bring out the the pistol if needed. Still don't get how I'm getting set on fire. You know who you're messing with. You know what my favorite 
game is hide and kill. Like skills is not gonna be on point though, cause I'm gonna mainly be using assault rifles, bro. And the San Devastan. Oh, 
Still dying, that's crazy. Well, I guess we out of here, we killed old boy, right? Oh, what's this on the table? Come on, V. Let's get out of here. Push up. <sighs> Militech. They got those things buzzing around everywhere. Pass the gate. like the way you operate. Maybe you'd do some more work for us. Be more than glad to. Till next time then, V. Corporate gods willing. Oh, thought about what you said. About convoys, transport security, your offer. We're just not interested. Secure the area. Time we were on our way, Canal. All right. Holy then. shit, V. I was sure we'd walk out in one piece. Thanks, Jack. Solid as ever. Hey, yeah, you too, but, uh, hey, what's this about? You feeling all right? Yeah, I want to make sure, you know? We're good together. Come on I now. like how we do things. Come on now. I do too, V. I do too. Hey, let Dex know we got his toy for him. And then I say we hit the afterlife. <laughs> you know, do some shots. Smooth sailing. Luego, V. Luego. How things looking, Mr. V? Got the bot. And how'd it go? Run into any trouble? And what about the Militech angle? Sure, of course it was trouble. Royce couldn't have given two shits that you and Brick had shaken on it. How'd you get him on board? You use the Corpo woman? Met with Stout, managed to strike a deal. Well, well. Gave me the chip with the scratch from Maelstrom. One thing Stout forgot to mention. Chip was carrying a virus. Oldest Corpo trick in the book. I assume Royce was less than understanding. Virus attacked their systems, scorched a handful of Maelstromers. I took care of the rest. You got some balls, Mr. V. What about the meet with Evelyn Parker? Still on the to-do list. Uh -huh. That meet's the only thing that'll get you a chance at grabbing that chip. Parker will be waiting for you at Lizzie's bar. Good luck. Oh my god. 
Got him. That's game, Team baby. Pushing up on him. Let's go, boys. They were right here. Remember the name. Sorry. Oh, 